what is going on guys I'm back with an update video to my collection video that I posted about a month ago from yesterday I think and uh, a lot of you guys uh, told me things that I was actually missing so uh, I've got a few of those and I also got some new releases and some old stuff that I upgraded so so what I, I'll go over the stuff that I was missing that I was not aware of which I figured I wouldn't know so well actually first off we'll start with the uh, the Dragon Ball the magic begins I knew this existed but I didn't really want it but then I was like you know if I get everything and then I'm missing these two like why would I have just missed that out anyways I managed to get the VHS I do want it sealed if I can if I can get it this is not in the best condition uh, but whatever I have it so I am looking to upgrade that also I found the DVD which is pretty rare they're both rare but the DVD uh, I'm glad to have the DVD uh, those are the two things that I got that I was I knew existed but I really didn't want it but y'all convinced me so got that uh, also pretty much everything y'all told me I didn't have I ended up finding besides one thing and apparently there is a magic begins remaster that was in 2007 that is rare as crap and there's a video on it so I know it exists I'm just not sure if it's actually an American release but I think it is so I'm still on the lookout for the remaster of that so there is that uh, and this right here is another thing I was missing in the manga section and I did not know there was a collector's edition to a Dragon Ball Z volume one uh, it's super awesome and it, oh, I'll show you real quick but yeah this is an update to the my collection video and it's a hard it's a hard cover by the way so they're very awesome and uh that's not too terribly hard to get i was able to get it on the same day those two i kind of had to wait two weeks two or three weeks to find so not i mean could have been luck but who knows uh and next uh are two vhs's that i had uh used the, uh so for uncut gt the only two i would needed sealed were these two and um i found them uh super rare Oh, this is the uncut. You can barely see it, but from the back, you can see it. But yeah, it is factory sealed. I finally completed uh, Dragon Ball GT series and edited, edited and uncut and movies completely factory sealed. And as you can see, this one is very mint. This one just came in today. Very mint. Like, it's just came out of a box. But yeah, I finally have that, and I will show you the uh, full uncut of that. And then here's a new release that just came out, like, a day after posting my video, so... New releases on the way. We uh this can't this is a Walmart edition as you can see. This comes with uh, Dragon Ball Super's Part One through Three in a Blu-ray DVD combo. I guess no, not not DVD combo, Blu-ray digital, I think. But yeah, I'm not gonna open this because I already have the Blu-rays. But yeah, pretty awesome set. It comes with this uh, fig pin, whatever. I mean, very awesome display piece. But yeah, it's at Walmart and it's like. This retail at 90, 90, like six, but I think you can get it for like 70 now. So go out and get it. It's a very good deal. And, uh, yeah. Also, new releases on the way because we have the new steel books for, uh, Dragon Ball Z Blu ray coming out. Four by three, that's coming out. Oh, uh, we got a manga, uh, volume 11 of Dragon Ball Super coming out as well. So we got uh, quite a bit of things coming out. And I'm still on the hunt for about eight items now. In my video, I said seven. I was obviously missing, uh, those three. Got those. So now I've subtracted back. There's only one thing I'm missing that was added to my list, which was the remaster of that. So instead of missing seven things, I'm missing eight now. So uh, now for, just to show you the uh, the uncut tapes here, <clears throat> which I am super pumped to actually get finally done and out of the way with. Which, and then most of you know, like I had GT completely sealed. For a while, it was just a mixture of uncut and edited, and then I decided to get all the edited sealed individually, and then all the uncut sealed. And uh, yeah, I, I finally got all the uncut stuff, which is awesome. And my custom box up here, which makes storing these very easy, and you don't damage anything in the process. Very awesome. But yeah, let's see the artwork. I need to update my VHS video now, but I'm kind of waiting until I get more things because i'd only be updating two tapes because like you don't see tapes that often and uh yeah there she blows boys you gotta love it anyways that's it for the uh, uh collection update 
uh, yeah, just those uh, six things. And uh, um, yeah, that's it. So two laser disc, four from Walmart, two laser disc, VHS, and the remaster. That's right. So it is eight. One, two, three, four. Yeah. So four WalMarts, remaster, two laser disc, and the and the five Warriors edited VHS, and then that's that's it. So eight more to go. Thought it was seven. It was a few more, and now I got it back down to eight. So we're making this happen one day. And uh, not counting pre-orders, but yeah. Uh, talk to you guys later. Peace.